Hey friends, welcome to What a Nichols the Movie vi video log. I think video log. Video log, log works. Vlog. Uh, the vlog. The vlog. Welcome to What a Nichols the Movie video log or vlog if you want to marry the two. Um, my name is Jamtown, and this is the first episode of the video portion of www woodennicholsmovie.com it should be at the bottom of the screen down there and um, I am with a good friend of mine Mr. LTY which stands for Lee Thompson Young and he's gonna share some stories with you you know I mean everyone has a story about college life everyone that went to college at some point and and we're just gonna talk about them they're really funny and some of them are dramatic and some of them are sad but everyone has a story and so today we are going to talk about roommates so the reference to Wood and Nichols the movie is that our main character CG has an unforgettable roommate experience for my college survivors your question is what is your roommate from heaven or your roommate from hell experience for my um, college dreamers. I have an answer. No, okay, yeah, we're, we're gonna, gonna get go to, to the you. college gonna, dreamers first. Yeah, okay. for, your, for, my, for my college dreamers. Keep dreaming. Yes. Um, for my college dreamers who are my high schoolers who are on their way to college, that's, I guess, you're, you're taking flight. That is um, also the universal sign for on your way. Yes. If you, you know, are in a foreign country, like, you don't um, speak the language, say, I'm on um, my way. Yes, yes. Everyone would know what that means. They know what you're talking about. Um, so, for my college dreamers, what excites or scares you about having a roommate in college? I mean, that, that, that's a valid question, and I think that you've probably thought about this. So, this is actually, we've had the website for a while, so this is actually um, a question that I asked on December 19th, um, which was my very first post. And so, roommate stories are so juicy, I thought, for our first video log blog, that I might as well ask this one about roommate experiences. So, roommate what's experiences. Up? Well, you know, there's been a lot of just funny, crazy, you know, things I can remember that immediately come to mind as far as you know experiences that stand out for me. Roommates in college. Um, what is it? Anything specific, or just anything that comes to mind? anything that comes to mind I mean like did you have a roommate from heaven oh a roommate from heaven okay um I can't say that I had a roommate from heaven but I can say that I had a roommate from hell <laughs> and uh, that was one it was my junior year and uh, I was a, a roommate with this guy who shall remain nameless uh, but he was a, a bodybuilder and you know he was a generally a pretty cool cat but uh, he had to eat, he would eat a lot of protein, so he would cook like chicken breasts and, and, and salmon steaks and all this type of thing so that he could get protein. But which was which was okay, that's great. You cook for yourself. That I respect that. I don't do that myself, <laughs> but I look up to people who do. It's nutritious. So he uh, but his problem was that he would not clean up behind himself. So he would cook all of this salmon. The salmon was the, really the worst part because that is a fish. And when fish cooks and then is then not cleaned up after, then a certain aroma develops in the house. And he would leave like the pot in the, in, in the sink. He would put a little bit of water in it, which really is just better for the bacteria to breed in, I think. <laughs> and then he would put like the, the, the skin and the bones and the part that you don't eat, like the scales and stuff, in the trash can without a bag. Just drop it right there, right on the naked plastic bottom of our trash can, and then not take out the trash. So it's like two weeks later, I'm walking in my house, it's like someone was murdered and they left the body in my house. <laughs> like I can't even open the door, you know, I have company over there, like, oh my god, Lee, let, let's just talk later. They won't even come in the house. <laughs> and so I'm like, go on, wash the dishes. I'm like, what's up, man? Well, where is this coming from? I take the trash out and then I bring it back in and I look and it's like, just the nastiest thing you ever want to see. This cake, bones, and fish skin stuck to the bottom of the trash can. So, and finally, I, I took the thing out and 
poured like pine saw and water in it and scrubbed the trash can out and washed it and, and I, I told him I was like hey man we can't live like this because this is just it can't even be legal it's got to be some health code provisions against that type of thing so uh, we got it worked out but um, that's it, pretty ad admirable though that you clean the trash can well it was just admirable in the fact that if I hadn't, I probably would have thrown up. I mean, it's like I had to act, <laughs> you know what I mean? And when I discovered it, he wasn't there at that time either. He was out at class or whatever. So I was like, let me just go ahead and do this. But um, yeah, so we got it worked out. He, he stopped, you know, he started using a trash bag and taking the trash out and it all worked out. I, I do remember a smelly apartment. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. Jamtown came to visit me back in the days and uh, she was like, oh, Lee, you need to do something about that. I didn't know it was fish. <laughs> it was a, you know how guys' apartments are. It was like a combination. Well, he was, yeah, because we both went to the gym. but And he was like a bodybuilder, so it was just, it was just heavy. It was just heavy up in there. And, and, the fun, and he was the type of person that would close all the blinds and the windows and the doors. And you just walk in and it's just dark mm -hmm. and, and foggy. <laughs> it was not good. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Well, you know, you made it. College survivor. Okay. Sorry. We we were really excited about that I ending. I think we had a moment. We, I think we did. Yeah. You know, but we have to come back and give you the information because we do have information to give you. Um, we want to hear your stories. I want to hear your stories. I don't really know what he wants, but I, 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 want, to I, I want to hear what you have to say. I mean, but I'm talking about good stories, crazy, so better, just, better than the fish in the, in the trash can. Crazy. I want something even more. Just like out of this world. Just, just like, whoa, man, you're just like, don't lie. You know, tell us yeah. the truth. But yes. <laughs> yes, but um, you can head on over to www.woodennicholsmovie.com and you can hear or read some of the stories that were posted a lot of really good ones a lot of really funny ones december 2008 and you can also share your own stories so let's have at it let's do it and i will be posting up a new video log log every week on wednesdays so come back subscribe Thank you for uh, listening to my story and keeping up with Wooden Nichols.